Hello. Okay. Hi, my name is Becky Snowden. I am a I was about to say freshman. I am a sophomore at Scott Catholic. And this poem is called Introductions. I'm told that when your mind was just beginning to go and I was just learning to master words, I would always introduce myself, saying, Hi, you don't know me. And your response was always, Oh, but I do. Most people who know what Alzheimer's disease is and what it means and what it does typically agree that it's one of the worst ways to go. You forget everything. Family, friends, how to live, me. Grandpa, my memory from then is choppy, but what I do remember is walking into a ragged nursing home with ragged chairs and ragged board games, and as I entered your room, your ragged breath sent shakily through the filter in me. And I said, as I have always said, Hi, Grandpa, you don't know me. Well, it's nice to meet you. The air was heavy, I couldn't breathe, there was no fixing this. When you were moved to the nicer nursing home, the one with the popcorn machine and soft serve ice cream, my parents wouldn't tell me why. I held the stuffed beagle that you gave me close to my chest whenever we visited. I sat in the chair near the window, food and stuffed animal in hand, and I waited. I stopped introducing myself. October 31st, 2005. They say you went in your sleep, that it was peaceful. The guns that were fired in the rain sounded like thunder, and I hid under my mom's umbrella as they saluted you. Shoes and socks soaked with what I am sure were heaven's tears. Grandpa, they say you went while you dreamed. And at the time, I wanted to do the same. I miss you. My memory from then is choppy, but I feel that I still know you, but not the whole you, just the bits and pieces you left behind. I still have the dog by my bedside. The bullet shells from the firearms at your funeral are on our mantle in the frame with the folded flag they gave us. Grandma's new home is in the same wing you were in. She sits in the room across from the one where you died. Every time I walk there is the time I think I will see you again. Grandpa, I can still feel the rain. My soaked through socks, the ice cream, the heavy air, your hand. I can hear the heart monitor as I wait by the window. I want to let you know that I am here. And I want you to do the same. So I'll start. Hi, Grandpa. You don't know me.